Welcome back to Ageless Living. Well, Dr. Frank, we are back in the lab. We are back in chemistry lab, that's right. <laughs> and Dr. Dennis Higgins, nice to have you with us. Meet you, John. you know, the interesting thing to me about all of us and studying it and reading, you were one of the ones, one of the key ones, who said when this first came out, this can't be true, it's a fraud, right? Yes. You're the guy. Yes. All right, so something changed your mind, and you're going to show us a little bit about what did, I'm sure. Yes. But what have you found? I mean, you're a doctor, you've seen this product used by a number of people. What do you see? Well, John, some of the, one of the most dramatic things we found in the clinical study we did, one of the people, uh, a couple in the study, is a doctor and his wife who are heavy metal detoxing specialists, mm. and they were a participant in the trial. But what we saw happen to them is at the beginning, their baseline test, even they had heavy metal showing in the BTA analysis. Within one week, their kidney stress increased 50%. Within three weeks, their kidney stress was 50% less than their baseline. And at the end of three weeks, their immune system function and cellular regeneration increased 300%. You're kidding me. That's right. regeneration. Jeez. That's what you're talking about. Well, that's absolutely. Yeah. And you just don't see that with anything else that's available no. today. This no. is just absolutely no. spectacular technology. So, so yeah. let's go. Okay. You'll help me cheat, I can guarantee you. What we're going to measure here is the surface tension. Uh, what we're going to be doing is lowering the ring uh, into the water, and then we're going to be pulling the ring up. As the ring is pulled up, you'll see that in the background that the dial is, getting, uh, is going up. At right now, it's at 50 dyne, 60 dyne, 65, 70, and about 74 and it that's pulled where, away. And that means that's what the surface tension is, what it holds against the surface of that water. Correct, correct. So that, this is normal water. This is what we can normally expect. So what we're going to do now is take a capsule of microhydrin. Hmm. We're going to open it up into a glass here. So you're actually going to change the structure of the water, is what yes. I hear you saying, yes. right? Yes. Okay. This I have to see. And then we're going to take some distilled water. And we're going to shift the plate here, I assume. Oops. Oh, I see. OK. Uh -huh. So now we're going to. This is the, uh, what Dr. Saunders was saying, the, the alive water, right? This is water that's alive. This is what you want. Right. This Good is what stuff. you want. That's right. So now we're going to take it this, the tensiometer back to zero. We're going to bring the water up until it actually touches the surface. Now we're going to be pulling it away again. It just pulled away at 35 dyne. 31. Now that's remarkable. That is absolutely that's unusual. remarkable. That's very unusual. So I, I, I picture it as like going from thick, yucky stuff you don't want to smooth, nice, absorbable stuff that you do want. I mean, that's what a that's dyne a, that, is. That's right. Yes. That's what it yes. is. Okay. That's yes. right. That's so we've just reduced yeah. it from 74 dyne to 35 dyne. That's unusual. Normally, it measures around well, that was 45. Instantly. I mean, you just poured that stuff just right in. Here. Right now. Right yeah. now. Now, this one also interests me. Um, this is another meter. It measures as, um, some more things for us, right? Because Correct. you're talking to me about, John, you don't want an acidic body. Right. right now, you have to tell me what that means and why I don't. And then you're talking about um, the change in what you call the biological terrain. Right. And what that means as far as the electrical current that's in my body and all that sort of confusing to me. So can you put it? Show us what this meter does. And Basically, what we're going to measure terms. with this meter is the pH. Right. And we want to consume things that's going to create a terrain in our body that's alkaline. Okay. Our terrain is normally acidic because the things we're eating are creating an acidic terrain. So and, a acidic terrain and a terrain, again, is? Yeah. Terrain, it, very simply put, is the environment that everything grows in. Right. So if I have an acidic body, then I'm, I'm almost begging for diseases you, to take place. You, you, you have very lie. fertile ground okay, for a disease gotcha. to grow in. If right. you were Makes an alkaline sense. terrain, then it would be very, very difficult or impossible for them to grow in an alkaline terrain. In one, you're going to help the body in its immune function. Right. And the other, you're fighting against it. Correct. Yeah. Correct. And it's Ooh. very difficult to change that terrain. To make your body alkaline is very, very difficult. Now, I've heard that what you're going to show us from many doctors up to this time was virtually impossible. Correct. Is that true? Correct. Wow. Okay. I mean, I've, see I've seen uh, terrain shifts in one day. In one day, what would, would yeah. normally take one or two years, yeah, with microhydrin we can see in one that's day. That's the process of wow. that. It's amazing. Okay. That's, and, so. and this meter, 
I mean, we're, we're speaking, we're talking about it as many people speak about things, but this meter gives people the ability they can actually to actually see it. see it, measure it, so that it's real. It's not a story. So Assurance. what we're going to do, this is, All right. this is some distilled water here, this and we're going, to, uh, we're going to measure what it is before we put microhydrin in it. Okay. My goodness. This is your uh, normal distilled water. The pH is 3.8. One, the ORP or the electrons is plus 452. The, the more plus, the worse it is. The more plus, the more oxidized it is. Oxidized. Okay. The more minus or more, the closer to zero, mm -hmm. the better it is. The food you eat is around plus uh, 200, between plus 100 to plus 200 in that range. Your fresh juices are around uh, 100 to zero your very best, freshest juices are maybe minus 100. Huh. But this water right here, this distilled water, is plus 452. So very bad for you. would not want to drink that water. And most people just... It's not as live. It's just it's, that's dead right. water. Right. All right. This is the bad news. The good okay. news is, is that what happens to it after we add microhydrin? And again now, this was that same distilled water that we put the microhydrin in that we used on the surface tension. Exactly. Okay. Now we're going to see so what happens. So what I'm going to do is happens. turn it off just a little bit, put in the first thing we're going to measure. What was the pH? pH is what Three something, wasn't it? Three, okay. Uh, I don't remember The now. pH now is 9.50. Wow. And still climbing. In the alkaline range. Which is which an is, incredible words, shift. That's a, yeah. In layman's that's, terms, this is what I want. Oh, right. this is this is pure and simple. This is wonderful. This is and the way I'm going to live a long life. Right. About the energy this stuff level. In my so the energy level was plus 450. Okay. Now the energy level is minus 570, 580, 590, uh, more than minus 600. See, Where does the chart end? Was you going to blow this thing away or what? The the maximum theoretical energy level is minus 800. So you're pushing the envelope right so here. So we're, yeah. it's still climbing. We're at, at minus 646. We're going to be minus 650 real quick. Basically, Jeez. what happened is we went uh, from plus 400, then had the actual electrons were about one. Now look at this. A minus 600 is a quintillion. Of that, you couldn't even, I don't even know you what can't it is. Put your brain quintillion, a quintillion. It's more than this in my checking account. That's right. That's right. exactly right. Is one right. and 18 zeros. Wow. From this capsule of microhydrin, we just measured a gain of one quintillion electrons. Well, I am well, anxious to see the person that created this. Do, we're going to have Dr. Patrick Flanagan. Can you believe that? That's huh? wonderful. I'm excited about that. Dr. Higgins, you are amazing. Now, thank you for sharing this. Thank I'm you. I'm very impressed. Thank you. Okay.